The Yes. Oh, wait, hold on. I mean, fucking, fucking tell me what. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no, 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 no. Not, no. not in the after show. No, we have to do maybe, the. Maybe, we have in to, the, maybe in the after show. I don't know. I mean, you want to say it's either now or around. next week. Yeah, can, can we wipe off this? Can we get stool? a towel? Can we? Can we get? Can we get it's, Brett Weaver up here it's with been us? Snorted <laughs> beers multiple times. <laughs> oh, I mean, uh, now we're just literally we, doing we, things we, so we, Brett we, doesn't show up again next week. <laughs> we we cer- we certainly get an A for effort, right? You're, I mean, pull in, pull in. Oh, yeah, right. I'll be off to the left. Oh, goodness. Uh, so, uh, you know, joking aside, you know, it's obviously very easy to snort beer, I'm sure. Yes. Uh, it, that was more intense than I thought it was going to be. Wow. I... No. <laughs> but God bless you for doing it. Uh, uh, for whatever reason, I thought that that would give me uh, more self-esteem. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, boy, did that one backfire. <laughs> I mean, I've heard of snorting the pain away, but that didn't really. I'm like, oh, I, I get the belt. What if I snorted beer off it? And that's about as long as I thought that was going to be a good idea. And it's about that plus one second until I was like, that's a terrible idea. I should not I have done it. I was today years old when I discovered this snorting beer that is a terrible idea. snorting beer is a bad here, idea. Put this right here. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah. Jesus. We're going to sell this one on eBay. It belongs eBay in with a museum. The, yes. With the, uh, with, with, with the baby dollar. teeth. <laughs> Here's our hope. Jomo lives very relatively close. And I want to make it so easy for you, Jomo. Just swoop on in. Do a showcase whenever you feel like it. Stay as long as you like. Tell the whole family it's work. Well, I think I think uh, uh, Jomo made a mistake when we did a live show a couple weeks ago. And he played and then set up on stage that he's been writing songs for a year. Uh, uh, one, one a week. And Brian and I looked at each other like the dude in There Will Be Blood, like finding like a new oil preserve. And we're just like, really? That's a lot of, no, uh, trust me. Like that's like saying, oh, there's not a lot of oil. Like there's just a little bit of oil. We're like, we'll be the judge of that. We'll be looking at those diamonds very yes. closely. It was like, a, uh, it was like all of a sudden in my mind, it was like, Stratus contact bearing two four five Karim one one three Galactica class cruiser of comedy coming our way. Coming, is that coming through? I have no idea because there's Price? no monitor. Uh, no, it's not coming through. Damn it! Uh, you have to hit bypass and turn bypass off. I did. I did both of those things. Those two things you said are things I did. Check check check. Wow. Maybe you need to do more of it. Oh, you know what? Because you're not using the right mic. You got to use the the uh, mic. That's right. <laughs> You guys swap uh, mics on me. Put that right. There we go. Yeah, yeah you want to bring that up to mouth height. What I meant to oh. say. <laughs> All right. Uh, one of us just snorted beer. All right. <laughs> <laughs> and I was not that person. Latest contact bearing two one seven five four four three. Electrical class comedy incoming. Jomo class blue. Blues musician. Don't we engage? <laughs> Although I did love the fact that apparently uh, uh, to take our our performance to another level, uh, there were actual audio problems during his Mr. Lo-Fi uh, blues <laughs> song. Uh, yeah, I don't know why that happened. It, it like it it's exactly as you described. It was perfect in the sound test. <laughs> Third time it's happened. He says he took it to the car stores. Two different guitar stores. Yeah. What? What? I, I, Jomo, I, I, Jomo, I remember yeah. when you brought that up, uh, and you were like, "What if there's tech problems?" And I said, "I walk up at the games till he dies playing." <laughs> end of end of line. I have had <laughs> a, a similar situation, and uh, using a guitar with the a brand new uh, thing, and then when I try to connect it to my mixer instead of to my amp, that changed it. I couldn't get it to work, but and it worked before. This is a, a plug-in, unplug, plug-in it's, it's like right. It's like oh, I told you at the venue in the middle of the show. I was shouting out. I was like, hey, Jomo, you better get your guitars ready. You're like, 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 like,
what's what's great night? And I'm like, it's, it's a, a show. show. <laughs> <laughs> it's called eventually <laughs> become. We haven't revealed, revealed the name yet, yet. so it's a little bit confusing. Also, I'm laying on the East Texas a little bit thick. I won't go back to the bar. <laughs> you may think you may think this is a big game, but it's not. <laughs> I don't think this is any type of game. I think that this is a game. Wait, no, you know, wait, hold on. No, 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 no. Keep going with the fast nine. With fast nine. No. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You know, we got another hour. Let's just do that. No! Keep on talking about what happened in, in, in the fast nine. Oh yeah, that's right. I really wanted to know what happened in fast nine. Okay. The Dom, the only character whose name we know. <laughs> he cares a lot about family. I mean, I didn't know that. I mean, he just killed most of it. It was terrible. <laughs> oh, that's another, that is a funny thing that uh, uh, Joe Ma may or may not know is that Brian and I, after we first heard the Mermaid song, just for like randomly, I've just been going back for, and for forth a week for straight. For a week straight, just, no matter what slightly annoyed us, we would just go. It was total, total bullshit. <laughs> it was total <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> that whole <laughs> movie <laughs> was total <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> I have a confession to make. Yeah, I the only Fast and Furious movie that I've seen is Hobbs and Shaw. So that was yeah, Brian. I remember, bet that remember, one made sense. Uh, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, sorry, it was fun. Yeah. Whoops, it was fun. It, was fun, it didn't yeah. make sense. Yeah. Um, how 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 loud on this monitor can we get, Bryce, before uh, it starts to mess up things? I'm I'm turning it down because I I don't know who's going to be doing what, but uh, you tell me uh, when when is enough for you. Uh, what, uh, like, 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 from where we're standing, hear more of we, yourself? we literally can't hear anything. Check, check. What? Check. I, I can, I, I can, can hear, hear, like, it's, it's, oh, check. hello. Check. There it is. That's kind of, that's kind of. Uh, no, so this was the thing that, uh, I, I don't know if it was very funny to me or very uh, annoying. The chat room, they have discovered that we have two voice modulators. We have two voice <laughs> modulators. So far, we have only created three characters. Well, no, this is a one character. Is 1970s Battlestar Cylon. Yeah. What was the, the other, other one? Is the Master Control Program from Tron. Okay. That's me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, sir, we know with you. And then, wait, what was the third one? The third one is man yelling from the back of the crowd. What is that? Yo, buddy, buddy, that's, that's me, me bro. bro. Yes, we hear you. Well, this was one that I came up with, and I don't know if it's really stupid, so I need everybody in the chat. Whatever it is, it's probably racist. I don't have to worry about that because I'm a Cylon. And whatever happens next, I want to affirm that me, Brian Brushwood, the person who is definitely a Cylon and not a human, this, has nothing to not do as with as whatever understandable as Mr. Robert think. Young is about to do. <laughs> He's... Uh, he's man. just covering his ass because it might be racist. Uh, does it have to do with yarn? No, you know, that it one doesn't. Didn't work. It doesn't. <laughs> it's 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 a thing I just call <laughs> Indian flute. People are saying oh. that they can't understand what I'm saying because the bass is too great. Perhaps I shall have it happen. No, that made it worse. As you asshole. <laughs> you, you asshole. You asshole. I guess that works now, I guess. But... That's great shite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know what he said. I, I don't know what he said. Can... No, I can't. No, I'm not going to do the racist thing without an intro. <laughs> No, I don't want another intro. We're just going to slip it in. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Uh-uh. Oh, no. No. All right. oh, no, no. And that's the vocoders for the evening, hey. everybody. Thank you very much. Good use of our time. Turn we'll, off. We'll, yeah, we'll, on we'll figure it out. <laughs> the, the thing is, Justin and Brian and Brett, I'm sure, can hear each other very well because they're up in front of each other. Yes. Ugh. Very, very hard to hear. <laughs> so wait, uh, it's it's hard to hear through the board. Uh, yeah, because there's no dry. It's all just. Is there any? Oh, oh no 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 no. That's a slider. That's a <laughs> you got slider it on the wrong the side. I don't no know. no yeah you can mix it a little bit. Right. Uh, uh to do that, but yeah. Uh, there we'll we go. Play with it. That's fine. We'll play with it. Well, we'll get it right. We're gonna. We're... What's what's a dry? 
It's the unprocessed signal. So like your voice as opposed to just the effect. Yeah, but yeah. but but like what I'm hearing out of there sounded like all just the effect. But exactly. I guess it doesn't right. sound because that you don't have any wet. Where or you don't have any dry. You're all wet. Yeah, but Cylons are all wet. Okay. Which is well, weird we're, because we're, they're we're, we were trying to tell. That's what <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Hello, everybody. I, yeah, spoiler alert, that character is going to be another robot. <laughs> 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 because that's all this thing does is robot voice. Uh, well, uh, uh, all right. Jo- Jomo, you, uh, uh, what's your schedule like? You, you got a bounce or you got time to, to hang for a bit? You got time? You got time uh, for one more? Uh, 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 it, oh, shit. Can we hear a song? I was, I was just going to debrief sure. him like, like a prisoner. <laughs> I think we were gonna read who the is, riot who, who act. Is, no, 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 no. Who was forced to watch like a like like a, like a test audience, and and I was gonna be. All is like, this gonna be just you apologizing for the show? No, it's gonna be investigating. And In, oh, like market research. Yeah. On a scale of one to ten. Yeah. How much did you understand the show? S- With one being, I didn't understand at Strongly all. Strongly agree. <laughs> slightly agree. <laughs> neutral. Somewhat disagree. We're just Strongly find disagree. Him like a, Are like you a, like a me? mom at the mall and yeah. just like quiz him on like which of these feel the most soft. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, the moment when the guy was snorting the Robert Earl Keen beer How that that's make you rebranded feel? as McConaughey's. Uh I just want the chicken sample. That's all. I don't. That's it. That's That's the uh, answer. uh, Well, here, we got another mic. Uh, Jomo, come on up. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, Jomo. Jomo, come on on this side because I'm taking up too much of the screen here. The man who has occupied most of the Joe, Jomo. Oh, this is fun. (laughs) What is happening? Why are we taking things off things? Because then that way we all have. Hey, there we go. We're holding the mics. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good I'm idea. I'm trying. Right on. I was most disappointed because I was going to watch Fast and the Furious. And now, <laughs> and now, now it's been ruined. The whole thing's been I was shocked. For you. I was shocked at how much. It really was like kind of a sign of how much your brain gave up that you remembered so vividly the first 15 minutes. And then <laughs> and we're then like, it, then things, places, yeah. people, like, stuff. And then at some point, Dom goes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was. I have only seen. Um, I think I've seen one Fast and or Furious movie. Which I'm one? Not, well, uh, I, I don't. I, you, you know what? You no, no idea. It's one where they were but, family. No, no, there was no, no, cars. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna play twenty questions, and we're gonna figure out which one it is. Yeah. Um, were there anybody Asian in it? Oh. Were there Asians? Yes or no? <laughs> yeah, I would say no. No, no, so no agents. Not even drifting one. Not none. No, no drifting. Okay. Uh, oh. I guess no, it no might drifters. have been the first one. I think I saw the first one. Yeah. I think you saw the first. God, that must yeah, be it. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, yeah. Got it. I, <laughs> then, I wrote a song. Hey, now you had to snort another beer. <laughs> <laughs> I got like PTSD about losing every game we played. <laughs> <laughs> I did write a song called "When Will It End?" The Fast and Furious franchise. Yeah. But then Paul Walker died, and it was felt really insensitive. Uh, like it was for a while. Yeah. I was Why like, "Why did it feel insensitive?" <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, well, I mean, there's like, a whole this, breakdown this is, this is of like, were... like, die, Paul, die. Like, yeah, yeah, it was, Paul it was about that. Die. That was most of what it was about. <laughs> it was... <laughs> somebody, I'll bring it back. Somebody save me. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, man. I, I, I feel like. Uh, uh, why are you writing all these songs? <laughs> a lot of people want to know that. Stop. Uh. Because for the record, that Mermaid song, which, again, has been in Brian and I's head for the last several weeks, you wrote hours before you yeah. did it live on I stage? think I wrote the day before, uh, yeah, the, the event y'all were at. Yeah, I've been, I don't know. I've been, um, I like to write, but I have, I have, um, I'm kind of a perfectionist. Yeah. And I obsess about things. And so I don't ever write because I don't, I, you know, that thing where you say, is this you're brainstorming and there's supposed to be no bad ideas and then but then you're if you're just by yourself you go and that one's bad that one's bad that one's bad that one's bad and so I never wrote anything. And there's so, uh there's actually a, de- uh, a department over at the University of Texas here in Austin where they do developmental psychology and a lot of people have that problem of perfectionism and I'm told they show them this program as treatment. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And they, they, they say, they say, they say, uh, look at uh, this. They, they, they pour a beer on a tray <laughs> and yeah. they snort yeah. it out. I don't have anything to snort it with. Yeah. It's too your answer. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. So, no, I, for what it's worth, as a spectator, uh, it was, uh, I'm impressed because it does seem. You know the what's happening is terrible, but what's <laughs> the production quality? The production, quality. the production quality is amazing. Absolutely, that's it. You know? looks I mean, like, like somebody's doing some ta- some If you got shit. some talent in here, it'd be like, it'd be, yeah. Stop <laughs> it. Yeah. The good news is you can cut out all the bullshit. <laughs> the great uh, uh, couched uh, compliment is, well, you guys look like you're having fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's all that matters. <laughs> yeah. No, it's awesome, and it's like it, yeah, this, I feel this like is I'm the first in some sort not of only in the studio, but also just on Brian's property in general. I, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't even seen, seen the it. place. I've I've seen a little bit on Modern Rogue of the building, and I've seen some some videos. But to come out here and check everything out, it's amazing. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, it's like you, it's acres. And when 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 you moving in, I got the agreement. Yeah, all I saw written the up rooms and, over there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll just uh, you know, I'll just y'all. Poke me out of bed, and I'll just roll out of bed and come in and play Grab something, and then back to sleep. Yeah, yeah, back to sleep. Yeah, that works. Uh, okay, so which which will and and this is kind of a debrief. Which will be better to get Maximum Jomo on the show is to save our powder and have you out like I don't know once a month maybe, or to make it real easy for you to swoop in and do ten minutes and then leave. Oh, good question. Yeah, no, I got to think about that. I like both every of those single week ideas. Yeah, I don't know. I need to think about it. Also, he, didn't, he didn't notice that every single week part. No, yeah, uh, Brian. I slipped that under the radar. Brian, Brian is in this, and this is this is maybe the most real the great night has been so far. But <laughs> Brian is right now in this situation where uh, uh, the comedy in general, I feel like, and correct me if I'm wrong, has always been a point of like, why is anybody watching? Uh, but also, you're very proud of this facility, and you are in your heart very proud of this show, and so now. Brett and Jomo are just these people where you're like, I don't know, there's this thing. It's terrible. It's awful. But if you'd please show up every like single it. time, I would really like to build an amazing team. I, I, I don't want to say why is everybody watching or why is anybody watching so much as to say, uh, like, I've known that uh, at the age of, what, uh, 29, 30, when we first started doing stuff online, that uh, I was a magician, and I know that the reason magicians become magicians is because they cling to structure, yeah, recipes that will tell them how to do X and do Y and have the jeep chop and the flaming wallet, and then everyone will clap. And yeah, and I held on to that a lot. And to go out into the great wide, uh, terrifying void of just be funny was very terrifying for a very long time, and still is. But uh, at the age of 46, when I checked my, uh, do you know that 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 uh, 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 the bank of fucks checks how many fucks you have? Really? Mm-hmm. I'm where, where, where's I'm your balance? Very low on fucks. Wow. <laughs> yeah. You are. And so, you're, 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 and so then all of a sudden it becomes a lot more fun you're, you're, to just yeah. be funny and and, you're, and you're, you're, you're gonna check your balance one day. It's gonna be in brackets. I'm <laughs> negative. Yeah. 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 Which, by the way, when and I was in my red. 20s, I, I called my mom and I'm like. Hey, what does it mean when your balance is in uh, uh, parentheses? <laughs> yeah. He's like, it means you have negative money. And I'm like, I shouldn't have called you. I'm going to talk to you later. I mean, all I know is that I checked my balance of fucks and they said it was outstanding. <laughs> uh, no, I mean, I, I, number one, I, I think in, in continued real talk, that's an amazing situation, especially now, because we don't have the ability to sit down and have like your posture hide any kind of nervousness. Like we are now upright uh, uh, uh well, doing and, like and, physical and, comedy and, and, at all times uh real talk uh in the early days uh back before justin tv or Ustream or anyone started cracking down on copyrighted stuff we could always hide behind like here's a funny viral video here's, yeah, yeah. Here's, exactly. a, here's a guest we're gonna throw under the bus we're when, bad friends yeah whenever you know? whenever you feel uh nervous you're just like i don't know like here's star wars <laughs> this yeah. lady got it on. Yeah. Here's all of it. Here's all of Star Wars. Then nine hours later, you show back up. Anyway, guys, uh, who wants to? Anybody in the chat? Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, this is show number two. Like yeah. this. I mean, I, I, yeah, this is just gonna take a little bit of of uh, just getting into that groove. I feel like yeah. that's totally normal. But it it seemed great. I didn't feel any any weird. You know. Oh no 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 no. I, no, I, no I think I, I think the like... shows the shows going great. What I find interesting is 
uh, uh, Brian's uh, 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 recruitment phase because oh yeah oh, you, yeah. you, you are no, no, no. you are like I, I, you are like you are like I if, want if, a if, Sergeant if, Pepper photo of like seventy five yeah. other people but, and I want to be just one. But little the funny phase. thing is that you're like if. Uh, Nick Fury was played by Woody Allen. Like, <laughs> you're just like, so there's this tip. Yeah. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe, get maybe you're busy. <laughs> I don't know if I you're busy know. on Tuesdays, but like, it's called the we're strategic <laughs> homeland. <laughs> you know, like, I'm just saying I'm tired of your bullshit stock. Like, but I mean, if, if that's a problem, then don't worry about it. It's okay. It. I'm just going to get another one, and we're going to get another one, and it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. No, but it, but look, uh, 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 I, I, I find it inspiring because uh, I do think that we are going we are putting together something amazing here. We're going to have people, uh, uh, people came in from out of town last week uh, 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 to, to help us. We got Heaton coming in next week yep. uh, from out of town that's going to be on the show. So, uh, uh, and... You know, for the first time in, well, ever, like, I was talking to Scott Johnson, and I was like, hey, look, why don't you fly down to Austin, and, and you just come down for a couple of days, you do the morning stream from here, we fly Brian Nibbett down, too, and, and we just do a nice little crossover kind of thing. So, uh, the fact that we have this studio, we have this uh, ability to do it, and we have other amazing, talented people that are local that are coming in and being a part of it, I think just speaks to the amazing kind of supernova that you've created here. Uh. Jomo, here's a question I literally cannot conceive of the answer to because everything I know about you, I, I know that you have a family and a life and you play music and you write brilliant stuff. Sounds like a ransom <laughs> note. <laughs> no, no, no. I know you have a beautiful family and great musical talent. Please send... <laughs> 10,000 in Bitcoin to I, it would I be a you. ransom you're, dot are you. You're a good Christian. Uh, no, uh, uh, my question is, I, I don't know what comes after my question, which is, <laughs> what what are you into in your... <laughs> Like, like, what do you, what do you consume for fun? Is it video games or movies yeah. or TV or books or sci-fi or like, like, for example, yeah, let, let, let me put it this way. <clears throat> Let's run a simulation. Yeah. Hello. You want the vocoder? Hey, hey. No, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> uh, hey, Andrew Heaton, it's me, Brian Brushwood. Oh, hello. It's I, Andrew Heaton. Andrew Heaton, I know that you run the political orphanage. You're a fantastic mm -hmm. uh, comedy satirist. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Uh, political aficionado. I'm wearing a top hat. Right now. Uh, yes. Uh, 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 you know what? Uh, I'm going to make a guess as to what yes. you like when you're not doing those things. Yes. Science fiction. Oh, I often wear long pajamas and read Robert Heinlein. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. I figured so. Uh, are, are, and I assume you're well read on the subject. Indeed. Uh, maybe uh, occasionally you, you, you read uh, uh, the work of other humorists. Indeed. I often pour myself a tall scotch and dive into a Dave Barry. <laughs> you are shockingly close to your, to your Goosebumps impression. <laughs> Later in the night, everybody becomes R.L. Stein. <laughs> so uh, that is a question. Technically, I, they both I, live alone. I Sorry. Don't, I don't, I, I, that's oh, a question I don't know the answer oh, to. Oh, wow. That one, that one hurt All right, me. Fuck me. That whatever. One, I'll start oh. another line of beer when you get there. <laughs> I live alone. All right. Oh. It's the character. I can't roll a blood. It's the internet, Bryce. Everybody's living alone. Oh. I like hot tubs. Uh, uh, yeah. Anyway, what's it like? <laughs> <laughs> Netflix? What are you into question. on Netflix? Is the simulation over? Yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, I I like to watch movies. I like movies. The first word of everybody in the afterlife. <laughs> is this is simulation? Simulation, the simulation over. Simulation is this over? starting or ending? <laughs> what, what, what movies are you into? Uh, we, I like pretty much, so where I grew up, I grew up in like outside Abilene in the middle of nowhere. We didn't have movie theaters, as we mm. called them back then. And theater. then I learned later, they were like, you sound like an idiot. You got to say theater. Yeah. Theater. Yeah. It sounds like refined, right? Sure. Sounds it's all drive-ins. You have but, all drive-ins? No, we had we had, we had had a drive to the movie theater. <laughs> yeah. And it was like my, an hour away. And, and then it was a big deal. And then they an inn afterwards. We stayed at an inn. Trip. The coachman let us out. <laughs> <laughs> and... Uh, anyway, no, I, I don't know. I just always liked going to the movies. And, and so then I moved to a town that had a movie theater. And I was like, I'm going all the time. And I did. 
And then I got a family. I don't go as much, but I love going to the movies, I like watching movies. And I like, I don't care if they're bad movies. I care. I watch, I like going to the movies and just the being there. The eating, sense of it. The sense of it. Yeah. yeah. I don't care if they're terrible movies. Some there's as I've gotten older, there's a couple. Maybe I'm like, what, what, what's, what's your like favorite? Especially here in you know Austin, where the draft houses are, are all over uh, the place. They really put effort into like have festivals, a big too. like experience. What's your favorite like movie theater experience? Good, good question. I I don't know except I got this buddy Phil who plays in a band and they it's this is not anything they they go and play the soundtrack to the band while to the uh side of film oh, oh, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. so uh yeah. do they do the invincible czars stuff? yeah they, well a little bit but it's mostly like a sound like a score so but they're doing it live as it's happening and they do that at the they used to do it at the ritz alamo draft house yeah ritz, but they've, i guess they've closed that yeah but that was cool yeah, the other draft house does all kinds of, of great stuff Wait, like so, that. so so what movie did you see them do i saw like the to? cabinet of Dr. Calgary or one of those oh, old like, like horror there are horror films yeah. like they do uh Jekyll and Hyde and that kind of stuff. So yeah. I, uh, what, that's great. What has been the best cinematic either long form television or shorter form uh, movie uh that, that what's been the best surprise of the last I don't know I, 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 the best is always a loaded term. Uh tell me something here, here, you like here, 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 I got you. I got month. you. I got the yeah. answer. There's Go. a simple answer and it's probably old but Saving Private Ryan, I went to go see, and I didn't know surround sound with bullets was a thing. Sure. And oh, I was just like, shit. the first time I was like down in my seat, yeah. kind of, you know, I was Laugh like, a minute. Yeah. yeah, it was just <laughs> that. It's like, no, I, I, what's funny is describe is, the is... first 15 minutes of Saving Private Ryan. <laughs> okay, go. <laughs> uh, 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 I believe it, I don't know if it was Medal of Honor or the first uh, uh, before Modern Warfare, uh, Call of Duty. Call of Duty. Yeah, I think yeah, it was yeah. Call of Duty that, that brought that, that to life yeah. in a way that just blew my fucking mind. It was unreal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like the something that makes you feel like you're in the murdering a lot of murder. People. You're, yeah, well, you're you're potentially getting murdered. Yeah, but yeah. you know, you're trying to like, survive. Like, it's, it's your fight or flight. Reflex. It's like hide Is behind that... this guy. Yeah. Ah, God, yeah. please kill this man. Yeah, kill this guy. He's <laughs> that was that was a comment. That's what they said in the reviews for Saving Private yeah. Ryan. Yeah. So real, it'll make you pull a stranger it'll... in front of you and scream, "Kill, kill this, this man!" Guy. You'll realize you're a coward. <laughs> You will know <laughs> how much your backbone is less than yeah. your neighbor when yeah. you pull him in front of you and sacrifice him. I want to do it in Grindhouse voice where it's like, you will know you are a coward when you encounter Watch this movie. Private Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> the your Nazis are at it again, and your friend is lost in saving Private Ryan. <laughs> there are memories not from the primary <laughs> titular character for some reason in saving Private Ryan. Watch Matt Damon get really old in saving Private Ryan. It turns out he's a school teacher. I'm sorry I just ruined saving <laughs> Private Ryan. I think we there's a market for the recaps of the full <laughs> movies with just you telling it as it as you remember it or not or don't just say what you it remember. It was longer that, than the actual what we need to do is have on YouTube <laughs> just brought what Brian is saying and put it like to the actual running footage of the movie and yeah. see which one goes faster cuz i think he went in actual time that was in real time of of the movie cuz like again all the shit he was saying was from the first 15 minutes and the segment went about 25 Five. like yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, god damn it uh, it was good though. What about you, Brad? What are you into? <laughs> they go to like nine different cities after that. Like it is a globe trotting adventure. But the first 15 minutes burned into Brian's skull. <laughs> Definitely stop paying attention. Oh my god, a thing, a thing, a person, a thing. I mean, but that is the movie. The movie is just ball numbing action of just like <laughs> Oh, it's, it's, it's just like you just like like and then like somebody eats a missile and then like yeah. michelle rodriguez shits it out and goes oops like and and did i do that yeah and then <laughs> fucking I like vin diesel like the bites the head off a of corona and fucking drinks it and yeah. then says like family family <laughs> i do think that for young dom they pitch shifted him down because dom has become this superhero now uh, the funniest thing about uh, the fast and the Furious franchise is that it's the answer to the question, hey, in the Die Hard sequels, why did they make John McClane such a pussy? 
Like, like <laughs> because everybody is so superpowered that yeah. at some point, eventually, Dom is just going to shoot laser beams <laughs> right. out of his eyes right. because he loves family so much. Can, yeah. can, can you bring up the, uh, the the chatter that you heard about how to take things even bigger? Oh, well, the rumor is. Because Have they're going to make this? at least three more movies. Oh, my God. Of Fast and oh, Furious. Right. Why do you okay, say now, real, at least real, three? Real quick, real quick. Uh, we're that, that's we're like talking Ray about They've said yeah. that? Yeah. Okay, okay. If, right now, take a moment. Lock in your perception of how high uh, 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 the writers of F9 were. Uh, and now understand their mandate is to go even higher Bigger. each time. They went to fucking space in F9. Okay? Sure. Lock that in. Uh -huh. Lock in where you think it's going to go. Lock in your perception of how um, money-minded yeah. universal yeah. executives well, that, are. And by the way, nobody made a reference to the UPN series Homeboys in Outer Space, where they also went out into space in a car, which I true, thought true, was true fact, true money, fact. money left on the table. Sure. Uh, Justin? The rumor is that Universal, the studio that makes Fast and the Furious, is very, very anxious and has been for a while to combine properties that they own what are some other universal properties uh they could do the mummy uh, they back, could back do to men the in future. black men in black men in black and so so they they have been, that's funny you mentioned that Dracula. because initially they were into the doing Man. uh uh 21 jump street and men that's in black right. That I would love to see. Which would have been great. And then they wanted to do that in Ghostbusters, and that didn't work either. Listen, kid, uh, I know you're new here to Universal, but I need you to think <laughs> just a little bit bigger. So what if this franchise that is already built on oh, having American oh. muscle cars ride over lush uh, green plains? Jurassic Park. Boom. Boom. Yeah. Planet Earth. Oh. <laughs> See, I was thinking Journey to the Center of the Earth would no. be the next way to go. Well, and they haven't really done underwater yet either. So maybe an aqua. But that, but that, but that, but that doesn't have a Chris Pratt who now all of a sudden is like, like, what do you mean? I don't know. I control velociraptors. Oh, I'm really relatable. But and Dom's re like, relatable like family. Yeah. <laughs> and like, like, well, because these dinosaurs like, are family. Yeah. Wait. They all. Oh hunt. my God. Yes. They, of course. They, 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 yeah, these dinosaurs. They're hunting in packs. No. They're hunting like a family. <laughs> family. That's yeah. exactly. Right. It writes itself. And like, as the, much as you're like, fuck this, you're like. No, I want to fuck this. Like, <laughs> this is really sexy. As much as you're like, fuck, fuck this, you're, you're like, like, no, I want to fuck, fuck this. this. Yeah, I watch it. Is <laughs> yeah, I, I can imagine. It's like the Raptors can't drive, but they can. can they? Can it? Shit. They're the smartest species of all Velociraptors. The Velociraptors. They they have the they have the steering wheels with the ball on the so they can sit there. You know, it's got to be an automatic, but they can do it. There's got God damn it. This is like the thing is every time that I've told this to somebody, they've come up with a joke, and it's a really good scene in Fast and Furious. I forget who it was. I was listening to some kind of a podcast interview where they were like, yeah, I, I realized I was a great action writer because I kept trying to make fun of action movies. Uh, right. And then people Hold were on. like, no, this is amazing. Like, this is Dude. actually how you write great action movies. All right. So Dom is standing alone in a field. He's about to get killed by velociraptors who all happen to be a line. Boom, boom, boom. All three get killed. Car skids out. It's Michelle Rodriguez. And he says, clever girl. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Again. These are all great yeah. scenes. Come on. These and, are all great scenes. And, and they, the velociraptors get in Teslas. And which and somehow the Teslas understand their speech patterns, ah. and so it auto drives them. You know, ah, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, opening scene. Opening scene is like a TEDx where a TED event where where he's saying um, uh, the first ever adaptable speech algorithm ever invented. You don't have to choose English or Deutsch or yeah. Norgo. Yeah, 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 Elon, Elon Musk. Musk. Yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah. just exactly. Talk, uh, to uh -huh. it and life it'll... finds a way. <laughs> like, uh -huh. Finds a way. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Let's pick a uh, title here. Yeah. And also, let's yeah, we're here at, uh, cash those checks. Uh, we're here at nightattack.showbot.tv. Uh, some of the top ones here include Oh My Mother. 
<laughs> it's got to be oh my mother, right? Well, yeah. Uh, let, let's click let, on let's it. Keep going. Tokyo, Tokyo is the Mexico, Mexico of the world, oh, oh, which is uh, which was something that I feel was very difficult for us to walk past, but we had to because no, oh, yeah. yeah. no, 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 it's a literal, no, it's a literal line. It's a what? literal line in Fast Nine. Oh, fuck uh, off! No, no, fuck off! No, that, the that's guy, not the guy real. Says, this is all a joke. This is all no, comedy. No, None of this. Fuck off! No, 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 no. Tokyo, the Mexico. was that? Fred? No, 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 no. Is the Mexico of no, the no, world. No, 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 uh, no. I don't understand what that means. I, Mexico is the Mexico is the, <laughs> the Mexico world. Of the world. No, 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 no. Mexico is a country. <laughs> so no, the actual line Tokyo is, is a city. Tokyo is my Mexico. <laughs> Tokyo is my Mexico was the actual that's, line in the okay, movie. That's, it was that's verbatim. Mexico. Put it so, on I, I, yeah, I IMDb quote. Out, like, Tokyo is the Mexico of the world. Can we get IMDb on that, they one. Said on that? <laughs> uh, Some other ones. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, like, it says Mamma Mia, here we go again. I'd be willing to combine it to Oh My Mother, here mother, we go here again. We go again. Yeah. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, my mother here I go again. Man, I don't know. I'm all in on actually, Tokyo is the Mexico. No, world. I'm actually all in on Mission Picks is never coming to Android. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Leave him alone. Like allow. 11 people with one of them being one of my best friends. <laughs> Bryce and Dorsey. Six people. Okay, what sorry. Seven. Families do. Seven, seven <laughs> people. <laughs> would father. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Uh, wow, Bryce. <laughs> Bryce endorses Italian racism. I don't think <laughs> that's a fun one. I I just I said it was think, okay. I don't, I don't know think that he I endorses it. it. I I think he uh, uh practices it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Listen, uh, the fast and the brushwood. What do families do? Is pretty good. Mm -hmm. Everything enough, wrong Bryce. with F nine in two hours. <laughs> 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 the longer the every the every time, once in a while, like you that just you just realize that you got to clear the floor. Like <laughs> there's like every once in a while, where you're just like, like no, like, like uh, my, the best job I can do right now is shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see, we got some more. We'll find out if this violates TOS. Too many Bretts. Yeah, that's just Brian repeating all and the then spoilers. Too many Bretts. And then too many Bretts. Oh, yeah. Two Bretts, two curious. <laughs> Oh, two breaths of years. Still again. alive. Uh, help control the porn population. <laughs> uh, Have all your porn actors fade or neutered. <laughs> Bryce tweets the way I wish I could. Yeah, that's a that's a repeated that's, line yeah. for me. From VCRs to outer space. Uh, now spoiling F9. Fast 10, your seatbelts. Oh, that's what oh, they're going to do next. Fast uh, 10. Uh, <sighs> By the way, here's the other thing that were left uh, on the table during Fast Nine. No one hit the ninth function key. Mm. Would have been uh, smart. Oh. Would have been. Kind of makes you think. Makes you think, IMO. <laughs> it's a really involved Brett's joke that Brett set off Mike, but trust us, it was hilarious. I would like everybody in the crowd to understand if you do not have a mic in front of you, it is very difficult <laughs> for people to hear you. Well, what? And then he said, Ooh, my. Yeah. No, that's really. I like, the, a great point. I, like the, I like the fact that a proposed title is Ooh, My Mother, but not in a racist way. <laughs> uh, uh, shout out to IPoopMyPants.com, <laughs> who I met in person in New York at a meetup a couple weeks ago. And he introduced <sighs> himself by his actual name. And then with a bit of a resigned sigh goes, I poop my pants. <laughs> <laughs> At which point, I, I wish I could have. I, I wish I could have lifted him up in his chair like a bar mitzvah. <sighs> uh, okay. bar mitzvah. The right? one that we you, saw. One guy lifted one guy up by yeah. his chair. And yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Uh, so Jomo's total bullshit. No. 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 Uh, oh my mother, two Bretts. No. <laughs> Median variable viable <laughs> product. Mediocre viable product. Listen more. Uh, liner notes attack. Oops. Um, Air, I think I did accidentally. Yeah, I saw one did. that said you two did. Bretts, two furious. I like that one. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, the Kennedy wound are you, are you, is. Are you, are you a, like is... the improv actor who's like, I heard dentist. Dentist? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, de no, we were saying <laughs> Buffalo. Uh, the other day, uh, we were playing a concert, and we used to have this joke where we would say, we, we could play like one song and be like, thanks, everybody. You, you know, this is about the time when people start chanting one more song. You know, it's like our second song. And so we were playing like three songs in. I heard someone say, 
one more song. And I was yeah. like, huh. and it turns out he was asking for a different song, but I totally misheard him. And I turned it into this. I was like, we get it, man. And then, but everyone started doing it. Like they thought it was funny. And so every song we played from there on out, they would chant one what? more song. Like, oh, it's like, <laughs> at some point, you know, uh, he's <laughs> no, anyway, like, it's okay, so okay, the everyone. last song of the night involved mermaids. That's all I got to <laughs> say about it. <laughs> You got to do the thing where someone comes over the PA. The show is now actually over. Please yeah. get out. Please get out. Uh, let's see. We got some more here. Uh, uh, oh. A prolifically weird tweeter. I'll put that in my bio. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> it's an actual description of a friend of mine. <laughs> uh, a Bryce Koo. The Kennedy. I don't remember the Kennedy wound. The Kennedy wound <laughs> is. <laughs> Kennedy oh. yeah. I mean, Dealey Plaza, a yes. A casual but. joke about a bullet exploding out the back of somebody's brain. Of the yeah. Of the United States of America. But, it, but instead, in on, the porn on, version, yeah. in the porn version of Pulp Fiction, uh, the the the, the band aid on the back of yeah. Marcellus Wallace's neck would be from a cum shot so ferocious <laughs> that it, 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 it shattered the yeah. back of his neck. Yes. Uh, <laughs> and then how the movie for explaining that dumb. joke? <laughs> Cars are pillows. <laughs> they really are, dude. If you land in a car, you fly. Cars you just, are yeah. pillows. Oh no, people are just like they just land and they're like like oh okay. <laughs> Thank I God. I Thank forgot. God this this <laughs> hump of steel was here. I forgot this wet I, hump of steel. I forgot when I said it, but definitely I love Cowdoy in the city. Yeah. yeah. I remember that. Uh, I didn't really question it. We were kind of on a bit there. I'm assuming there's a cowboy character. In no. Line? Brian just I wanted think... to mention Cowdoy. I mean, I love Cowdoy, too. Cowdoy that's another in the one. city I is like the best. Uh, it's me. I'm I, Cowdoy. I have played individually Cowdoy in the city for all of my other family members without any context whatsoever. I think the most I've told them is the bit they're doing is they know they should be promoting their Netflix show, but they keep doing silly things instead. Yeah. Here's Cowdoy in the city. Every single one, including Bonnie, thought it was hilarious. Cowdoy in the city? <laughs> Cowdoy in the city! Okay. Uh, and then the movie gets more dumb? Then the movie gets more dumb. Uh, let's see. This this long one from Sunman. Brian presents oh, a synopsis like a of the first 15 invitation. minutes of the movie. Straight to the NPA. Uh, let's see. Much fast, so furious. Kind of a meme sort of thing there. <laughs> Guy who died? Great <laughs> <laughs> uh, Nine presents F9 Oratoria by Brian. <laughs> oratoria. Thank you, Dr. Artie, for using the word oratoria. That's Their good. aunt, oratoria. I'm God, is pretty good. Oh, that was a great one. I think we got a clip. <laughs> Their aunt, I'm God. <laughs> God works in two ways. Water, fire, fire and mysterious. <laughs> That's actually amazing. <laughs> that, that was that's a great actually one. really good. That's one. another yeah. one. Look, <laughs> guys, I I I said last week that I needed somebody to do in the live laugh love script. Eyeballs are the titties of the face. Yes. This week I need somebody to do God works in two ways: water, water fire, fire, and, and mysterious. mysterious. That's I need that in live laugh love fun. That's so good. That's so good. We're off to Etsy. Please, We're gonna get for this God's done. sakes, will somebody put that? shit in a fucking live laugh love fun just do it you're cool For to do it just sake, do God it damn it we brian built a fucking studio all you we're asking for this. you to just do make a shirt you can just put do this shit in live laugh love fun it's free money Fuck. for you jim come on dude we just both do this. snorted beer for you tonight how much more do you want from us we just need one thing it's good on to so put many. these lines in live laugh love fun it's in this good in so many levels. It's it's, it's fucking great. We're gonna get our own line of bed bath. <laughs> and I know there's so much I just call it bed bath. Yeah. <laughs> Why waste the other word? Oh my god, Brian's about to you. Oh my god. Well, can we get the bowl back on here? <laughs> Uh, um, uh, let's let's pick a title oh, we can get out of here. Like the 80s. Snorting like the 80s. Snorting like the 80s. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got oh, one. Uh, good. I got one of my jokes. I don't think that I'm gonna oh. stop smelling beer for the next three days. <laughs> like, oh no! You're like, where's all the beer? <laughs> oh, great, great snort. It's gonna be a great snort. Great snort. Oh yeah. yeah. All right, we're gonna we're getting down to the zeros here, so we're gonna go back up to the top here. Let's yeah. see. Uh <laughs> oh god damn no, it. No, no, not not no. Fish and Vic is never coming to Android. As much as I would love to get that tattooed on my face. <laughs> yeah, yeah, audible no. boos are happening in the crowd now. Um Tokyo, Tokyo is the Mexico, is the of, the Mexico world. of the world. 
Oh. No, it's got to be Oh My Mother. Oh My Mother. It's okay. got to be okay. Oh My Mother. We'll do Oh My Mother. Thank you yeah. to uh, Scoop and Nova Girl. Congrats. Oh. Uh, and everybody who uses the okay. Exhibition. Oh, by the way, it was S- also at the New York City meetup. Okay. Where, 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 where are we at on... Uh, uh, like, like, we always get a little bit loosey goosey for the post show stuff. Uh, 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 and I and I know we're careful about uh, full screening stuff for fear of takedowns or whatever. But like, you just want to watch Cowdoy. I just want full screen Cowdoy in the city. It's so good. Uh, how about this? How about we do another song from Jomo? Oh shit! And that's how we that's, go. Out. Well, that's way there better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can you write a song about that, a Cowdoy is that good? in the city? Is that good? Yeah, all right. Joe's going to go get his shit. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, uh, it is our absolute honor and joy to bring this show to you. Uh, I can say without even uh, uh, consulting Brian that these two shows have gone so much better than we even thought to imagine. Yeah. Uh, uh, thank you. By the way, you got about 30 seconds of our full undivided attention. If there's anything you want us to hear about any of any thing that we're doing whether you like it or not oh my god <laughs> can we right, get so, right one of those so, will so whips? strongly one agree so lightly whips? agree yeah right or don't agree at all this is a show worth watching uh here you gotta give up that uh stool so, oh, so, so, so can... oh crazy this is total bullshit this is total bullshit oh, you want to stand right here uh, you got it <clears throat> We'll try it. All right, so this will be it, and then we'll go out. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Thank you for listening. If you were listening uh, one more time, everybody give a big round of applause for Jomo. Woo! Yeah, not not getting anything out of that. Yeah, it's it's getting blown out. I think you got to... No, we are not doing that. At a rest stop in New Wave, Old Laredo, I met an old man. He said, I could tell by looking at you, you're not from this land. I said, yeah, I was just down in Cancun, douching around like Kenny Chesney. One, two many drinks, and the next thing you know, they arrest me. Jail, it was crowded, so I was forced to share a cell. And as my luck would have it, with a beautiful girl named Danielle, she was like no other woman I had ever dreamed of. So just like Kenny Chesney and his own biceps, we fell in love. We went out. When I get back to the border, I'll get my things in order, and I'll make her my wife. The jailer was hooked, hooked on Taylor novellas. He'd watch him in the closet so as not to alert all the fellas. He went in and and we knew we had 60 or so minutes. And when the cleaning crew took out the laundry, we made sure we was in it. We went, adios mio, let's head for the Rio. Our love is so strong, it will carry us on. It's almost as strong as our B.O. And so now she's in the restroom, sir, and I'm here talking to you. Our love is so strong, I know it can carry us through. 
He said, yes, but I am confused. You say you and your lady, you shared a cell? I said, yeah. Well, down here in old Mexico, we don't have co-ed jail. I went, ay, Dios mío. I'm making some realizations. One moment. Oh my goodness, that was that was a that was a low string, so it's not normal. Anyway, the song ends like this. Holy chicharrones! She's got cojones. This wedding is canceled, or at least postponed. No shoes, no shirt. I got this problem. Everybody, go watch Code Cowdoy in the City. Cowdoy in the City. Cowdoy. Woo! Get it, get it. Say goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. goodbye.